yes, we did have gay babies that other day, and of course, your my evil stepbrother um, did not die in that car crash. Although I did help you bury the police cop's body, though. Alright guys, so anyways, this week we're talking about embarrassing stories. Actually, I had two embarrassing stories, but I couldn't decide, and one of them evolved when I was really young, um, and peeing my pants during a Boy Scouts meeting. Um, so if y'all didn't know, I'm bisexual. So, not only do I like dudes, but I like girls. I feel like this is scandalous for some reason, because everybody like, just thinks that I'm going to end up with a guy. So, while I'm in my history of animation class, um, a wild fur alligator appeared. It was weird because nobody really catches my eye, and I'm just weird about relationships and everything because, um, that was my phone. Um, I want to have a relationship. I, I just want one. So anyways, Feraligator comes into the room, and I'm all like, oh, 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 shit, damn, did that just walk into this classroom? I really want to know more about Feraligator and just what kind of girl she was and everything. So around midweek or whatever, um, that's when I finally got the balls to ask her. I decided to take Feraligator out on a date, and um, the problem I had, though, was that the Thursday, because for Alligator was in my Tuesday Thursday 8 o'clock class. The problem was is that I had to just dash I just uh, I was too nervous to ask for Alligator out in person, so I just ran out of there as fast as I could. Um, Leafeon. See now Leafeon is a cool girl too, because I've just noticed since freshman year and she's awesome and she was in um my history of animation class with me. And so later I'm getting um for Alligator's number from Leafeon. Now in, um, now in Leafeon's group, there's two people who look like, well, the problem was is that I was having brain problems, so by brain problems I mean I forgot her name. But when I was texting Leafeon, I asked, hey, do you have for Alligator's number by chance? See, now this is where it possibly seems really confusing, because for Alligator and Ho-Oh don't really have the same letter names, but both of the girls' names started with T. So anyways, um, I had a problem of where I got Ho-Oh's number instead of Feraligator's number. So this whole entire time, I'm texting Ho-Oh while I'm pretending Ho-Oh is Feraligator. Sad part is that I got shot down by Ho-Oh. But on the plus side, I did actually get that date with Feraligator, and um, we had a really nice time and everything. Only problem is that now, being for alligator, I just not. Moral of the story is, don't ask out somebody via text message. Ooh. But that's the moral of the story. So I hope you all are having a great week and everything. Um, I hope this cheers you up, just to know that nobody can do anything wrong like I can. Um. Yeah. It's good time, it's good time. Also, um, Mario, I'm not sure where to get the video from and everything, so I'm just gonna go with normal intro this week. <sighs> um, although I do really like it though, I actually really do. Um, and thank you for the comment of giving us an original background that everybody else would have because, what can I say? Pate. And Katie, you were. Always more than welcome to creepy stalk me. Um, it's appreciated. It's appreciated. Oh yeah, I got a haircut. Anyways, other than that, I'll check you guys later. Bye.